and summary time. Okay. Da, 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 da. I'm not really going to belabor this too long. Uh, this is an amazing game. This is easily, I mean, since the first time we played it, we just knew this was something special. Um, I, like I said, uh, recently, I, I, may, I may have already said this, uh, recently um, rated every single game I've got. Spent a little bit of time doing it. I'm, I'm kind of a nut that way. I just like making lists. And so, um, of, you know, all 200-some games we've played, this came out at number four. Um, on my top games of all time. This, you know, and Jen agrees. It's absolutely amazing. We um, would never turn down a game of this. It's so much fun. Um, you know, obviously, we just love rolling dice. That's, amazing. that's, that's always a lot of fun. It's just, it's just tactile. It's, um, you know, and, you know the, the roll, the you know, luck. And um, this game is really, really good about giving you lots of ways to control and mitigate the, the roll of the die. Uh, if you've got tons of uh, renown, you can always re-roll. You can always um, flip. You know, a whole, you know Snake Eyes. Um, you, you pay four renown, suddenly, oh, it's double sixes. And, um, you know, and it's huge. And as you can see, with, her, with the Lays of Trois, there's even more ways to manipulate the dice now. So there's all the fun of the dice without any of the pain of the dice. So it's, I, I can't imagine a better implementation of a strategy dice game than this, which is why it's just an amazing game. But um, there's just so much to think about every turn. Every game plays out radically different depending on you know, the stuff that comes out. Um, you know, at the end of the game, um, you know, if you've been heavy into white, you'll definitely want to get a procession. Because um, that means you can, um, you basically, there's a parade through town that scores you a lot of victory points. I mean, the, the buildings that come out at the end are usually very uh, victory point oriented. Um, and, uh, you know, so that last turn is desperately trying to get the last big score, which is always very exciting. Um, you know the um, the struggles to push in and out and you know maintain control of these buildings and therefore control the dice is always very um, antsy. The oh god please don't buy my red six please don't oh you bought my red six yay I got two bucks or four bucks um, or eight bucks um, but I really need that red six but I can buy back from you you know the the back and forth of that I mean this game just plays amazingly two player I've never played it with more than two I would love to try it sometime with more because um, of course you get fewer dice and so there's even more interaction with everybody else as you're buying more dice from everybody uh, ladies of Twa which is what this video is really all about is an amazing addition I I can't recommend it enough um, you know these these things. Um, you know, there are eight in total, I believe, uh, you know, and, and so you get a, a unique uh, layout every time, give you a lot more things. Uh, it's, um, the purple dice are absolutely wonderful. I, I know some people think the purple dice are too powerful because you can't buy them from each other and it's just like guaranteed wild card. But, you know, if you're playing with a full, I mean, because you have so much more to do in the Ladies of Trois because of these, you really need that extra die. Um, so I, I think it's, it's a net win. You know, probably, and this is true for both the Ladies of Trois and this regular Trois, the thing that we love most about this game that's absolutely amazing is just how thematically strong it is. How all these cards you can do just make perfect sense. Of course, going on a hunt gets you, um, you know, more renown and influence because everybody's impressed by, you know, the massive kills you make. What a waste of military. You could be out there fighting the Normans and the Skirmishers and the Marauders, but instead, um, you know, you, you, you impress everybody, the fickle townsfolk, with your amazing kills. Or at least you impress yourself. And isn't that what renown is all about. Um, you know, and the, the different ways you can make money, so clever, so much fun. Can't recommend this game enough, easily. Just amazing. I can't think of a reason not to love this game. I'd love to hear it if anybody has any particular reason they don't love this game with all their heart and soul. Um, and that's it. That's going to be wrapping up Twa. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. It was useful to somebody. Um, look forward to my next video soon, or actually not soon, because I'm going to be going on the road for a couple of weeks, so I won't be back for a while. Um, but, in the meantime, everybody, uh, have a good time, and try to play some Trois. You won't regret it.